All right, so we're heading to Devil's Tower, and we're gonna stay at the KOA campground on the edge of Devil's Tower. And we'll bring you along. So uh, Devil's Tower, I've only actually been there once in my life and I was a little kid. I'm way excited because I've lived in Wyoming my whole life and I've never been to Devil's Tower. So I'm pretty excited. You know, it's, I think it's like the nation's first national monument. So it's right here in Wyoming. So it's pretty cool to get to go. Heck yeah. I think Eric and Elijah are hoping to see an alien. I know. Yeah. We do want to see an alien. <laughs> Welcome to Earth. That's what I call a close encounter. If you haven't watched Close Encounters of the Third Kind, apparently the KOA campground at Devil's Tower plays that every night. I know, so we're, we're planning on watching that. Heck yeah, it's gonna be a good time. Alright, so we're heading to Devil's Tower, we're getting closer, and uh, one thing I didn't realize is how many trees there was. I mean, it's kind of cool because when you look at pictures of Devil's Tower, it looks like it's in the middle of a field, but yeah, this is kind of nice. We're kind of going through a little forest here, and uh, we're uh, really close, only about maybe 15 miles away. Oh my gosh, it's just so much bigger in real life when we're driving up to it. It's, we're still several miles away from it. It just seems big and Alright, sweet. So we're at Devil's Tower here down at the base and we're actually going to walk through on some pass. It's pretty amazing how big that is. Wow. All right. What do you think, Elijah? Pretty cool. Yeah? What do you think, cool little buddy? Pretty cool too. Pretty cool too? Yeah. You think it's pretty cool? Yeah. Alright. Look at that big mountain. It is a big mountain. Is it a bear? It's a bear. Yeah. That's a big bear, huh? Why is a big bear up that mountain? Well, do you think a big bear made that big mountain? Why did that? I don't know. Do you think he did? Why? I don't know. <laughs> Wake up. All right. So there's two trails you can take up to Devil's Tower. There's a tower trail, 1.3 mile loop, and then Red Beds Trail. So just keep that in mind. If you like to hike, Red Beds Trail is going to be a little bit more hiking than the other way. But it's pretty cool. There's a lot to look at and all the trees. But this is actually a really nice, nice hike up there. We came to this sign right here. It says Tower Trail to the right. And that's 1.3 miles. And then Red Beds Trail. The green arrow to the left here and that's where you're going to go off-roading so if you want some exercise <laughs> take the red bed trail so we just follow this trail all the way up to devil's tower you know, hike around devil's tower it's you can see the trails here are pretty not too pretty even not too steep so uh pretty level flat I mean, so you don't have to worry about am I gonna have the energy to hike because there's not a lot of hills. It's pretty level. It's a good little hike around Devil's Tower. Good job, buddy. Ooh, ooh, muscle. 
Good job. Isaac, what do you think? You see a bunch of little rocks? Yeah. Big rocks too, huh? Yeah. Show me. Got to be real careful though, huh? Yeah, is that a big one? You climbing? Good job. Some of these little spots you're going to want to make sure you stop at on the trail because you can get some pretty sweet views like that. It's pretty awesome. So we're actually heading up to the base. And when you get to the boulders, you're not supposed to climb, of course, past the boulders unless you're a climber. You need registration for that. base you got these big boulders <laughs> big boulders everywhere on this trail and then when you look up the mountain here these big boulders I mean it almost looks like they fell off it or something there's the climbers I see them there's two of them Isaac, what do you think, bud? Yeah? Is this cool? Yeah, you like it? Can you give me a thumbs up? Boom! So what do you think, buddy? It's pretty cool. Yeah? Yeah, I get to climb on bunches of stuff, and it's pretty lit. I know, I know you like climbing on stuff. Tons of big boulders, huh? Pretty cool. That's yeah, awesome. All right, so along the trail around Devil's Tower, you actually come to this open area Cattleman's called Cattleman's Haven. So this is pretty sweet looking, great views. So when you're here, definitely come over here and get some pictures of this. So way down there is the KOA campground and our camper. So this is from a view up by Devil's Tower looking down. Then you'll be able to see, looking up from our campground to Devil's Tower as well. Pretty amazing. All right, this place is amazing. It's actually a lot better than I thought it was gonna be. I didn't know what to expect. It's like, it's just, you know, like this tower thing and then you yeah. go walk around it. I was like, hey, we're gonna walk around and look at a tower, but I yeah. actually really like it. Absolutely. I know in the, in the it's so easy to walk around it too. I mean there's yeah. nice paved paths around it. Yeah, so it is. It's like a paved path. It's not and, even like you're like hiking. And the entire the time or yeah, and the entire time around it you got views of Devil's Tower. Yeah. And it's pretty awesome. And I love it because there's like you're actually kinda in the mountain still though. So yeah. there's still trees and you smell that yeah. that pine smell. And there's rocks. Like I didn't realize how many just big huge boulders were all over around Absolutely. the bottom of it. So the boys think this is just the greatest place on earth. Like Elijah's climbing on everything, Isaac's trying to follow. So they're yeah. having a great time so it's actually a lot better than I thought it was going to be. It, it is a lot better and you know you mentioned the trees I think the trees are are great because it's it kind of you know gives you some some shade mm -hmm. especially since it's really hot out right now and you're walking around yeah. but uh and it just looks really nice you know when you see some of the pictures it just looks like it's like in a field kind of. Yeah and then some of the spots will open up and you'll see this huge like field like with like a open area and it's like oh my gosh it's just like beautiful piscaress so yeah it's really pretty. It's awesome. It's a great place. Yeah. Right over there. See him? See the little animal? See him eating? Yeah, they live in these holes. That's holes a, everywhere. It's a prairie dog. Do you see it? And all the little holes are their home. Do you see it? I see it. Well, there's a couple of them. What? Is there one in there? Oh my gosh! You're right, there is one right here. Ah! You see it, Isaac? Yeah. Is that so cool? Isaac, get back. 
You can't touch it or nothing. You're seeing it inside? See, Mommy, they did. You see it? Yeah. yeah. They do, they dig a hole down there, don't they? Yeah, they dig like this, Mommy. Let me see. See, they dig like this. Yeah, they do. Unfortunately, the closest thing that Elijah found to finding a real alien, well, not real, was stuffed animals. Dang it. Hey guys, this is the end of the video. Make sure that you like and subscribe for more great content that is ready to come. Peace.